Hey everyone, watch as the assistant and I make these super cool lava lamps using just a few things that you could find around your house. We make a red one, a blue one, and a purple one. Okay assistant, we're gonna use these bottles and make special lava lamps, right? Right. So this is gonna be these really cool lamps. So the first thing we do is we pour in some water. Ooh. All right, assistant, will you hold that for me? All right, you hold that there, and I'm gonna hold this, and I'll put in some water. Oh, oh I spilled the water! So this is, I shouldn't spill the water. Okay, so we got a little bit of water in there. And assistant, we're gonna put color in it and make it look super cool, right? Oh yeah, I'm putting purple and red. Purple and red, so I'm gonna put water in. All right. You know, I think I put too much water in, so I'm gonna take a little out. At least this time you can take a little out, because the last time... Remember, did you see the video where they exploded? <laughs> yeah. Oh boy. And now we've got to use this cooking oil. Cooking oil? Yeah, so it's actually vegetable oil. So we mix it's this like in. like you use for um, eggs. Yeah, so we pour this in, and wow. we fill it almost all the way up. And look, people at home, do you see all those little bubbles in there? Do it to mine. So we're gonna put a little bit more in. Look, all the water stays at the bottom. That's right, the water stays at the bottom and then the oil floats to the top. But that's not the cool part, right? Right, the volcano is. Oh, we're not making a volcano, we're making a lava lamp. A lava lamp. Okay. So now we let them sit for a second. Okay, so, so here is the water and the oil. Now I'm gonna put in a couple drops of Blue food color. You want to put some in? Um, I'll put some, uh... We're just going to do one color first. Now look. Okay, I'll do red. You see how they're kind of dropping in? All right. I'll start my red. And now, I'm going to put a little bit more in. And then we've got a secret ingredient. It's Alka-Seltzer. Do you think that's enough? Maybe a little bit more. Good? Yeah. All right, so, so this is Alka-Seltzer. It, it causes fizzles. And you put that in your side. Okay. And I'm gonna put this on my side, so I'm gonna have to bring mine a little bit more. So drop it in. And let's see what happens. Whoa! Uh, whoa? Look, look at yours right here. See all the little, the little color balls that are going in there? Whoa! That's right. So this is how we're making our super cool lava lamp. Whoa. Look at the assistance with all the red bubbles coming up into it. Red was a good color. And now mine is doing blue. I'm gonna add a little bit more blue to mine. Should I add a little bit more red? Uh, sure, if you want to. Yay. You never and then want to have. We can even add our lid to it. Where's my lid? Your lid is right here. Thanks. So these are our lava lamps. Look at that. Is that cool or what? Is yeah. Let's do one more in purple. Wow. So what do you think, people at home? Now watch. If we turn the lights off, watch how cool it can look, okay? Okay. Okay, people at home. So now we've turned off some of the lights. Now watch. I'm going to put my Alka-Seltzer in. Me too. And then I'm going to try to actually see if I can put this light inside of it. And let's see what it looks like. Let me do it. Now look at how cool that looks. Wow. Do you see? Look at the lights inside of our lava lamps. Wow. Whoa. Ha. <laughs> so these, and then you can even kind of shake them up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Watch what happens if you shake them just a little bit. Now I'm gonna turn on some lights just to give it a little bit more of a look. We're gonna shake it just a little bit. And look at our cool lava lamps. Mm -mm -mm. I think I, how do you get the light out of it? Uh, once the light goes in, it's kind of in for good. Oh. Wow. Whoa. Ooh, look at yours, assistant. Ooh. And look at mine. Those are our lava lamps. Let's make another one and Purple. So people at home, should we make another one and maybe use two different colors? I think that's a pretty good idea. What do you think? I think we should 
we should put purple in first. Okay, let's make one more. So we're gonna do another one, but this time we're not gonna put quite as much water in. So assistant, what do you think effect that'll have? We're gonna have less water in it, but more oil. Do you think that's gonna cause more bubbles or less bubbles? I don't know yet. You don't know? You're waiting to see, right? Right. So now we're gonna add our oil. Right? Yeah. We're gonna add a lot of oil this time. Uh, we might have added too much oil, assistant! It's spilling! Oh no! Uh, yeah. We'll remove this and maybe it won't be quite so bad. Okay, assistant, we've got the oil in the water. I took a little bit of the oil out because it started spilling and making a mess. So now your turn to add some food coloring. So uh, I'll put some purple in. So you're gonna put some purple in. Oh, that's a lot. Keep putting some in. Maybe a little bit more. That's good, right there. That's quite a bit. Oh, can we just do purple? Sure. Yeah. And now we're gonna put our alka seltzer in. Can Wait. I put some alka seltzer? You sure can. So put Let's put extra alka seltzer. Hey, I don't think it'll do anything, really. But it, but we need to put one in right off the bat. So go ahead and put it in. Make sure it doesn't spill. And we're gonna put a lid on it too, because it's gonna make gas, right? So it even might even expand a little bit. Oh. Yeah. So look at the bubbles come out, right? So look Whoa. at all that fizz. Whoa, maybe we should add a little more food color. I don't think we need to. So we're going to actually open this up and let it vent a little. And look, look at the purple. The purple is starting to come through, isn't it? Yeah, maybe we should put a little more food coloring. I think we got plenty of food coloring. Okay. But we can add a little light to it, right? Oh, that might work. So should we add this light right here to the bottom? Can I? Sure can. We'll just drop it in there, assistant. Okay. So we drop it in the light. Oh, you know what? At first, it didn't, it's, it didn't even sink, did it? Yeah. I don't think it's gonna be much of a lamp since uh, you added less water. So you look, it kind of stuck. So what happened was it didn't have enough, so it didn't float all the way through. But look at all the cool, bubbles we've got in our lava lamp wow. this time, assistant. Maybe we should shake it up a little. No, why don't we not shake it up right now? Let's take it and, and, and turn some lights off. And look at it. Wow. Can I have my red one and I'll hand you your blue one? Here's your blue one. So there's our purple lava lamp. And this one's mine. I just do this. To make it more. So you can shake color. it back up, or we can add more of our Alka Seltzer. Ooh, can I add some? You sure can. To mm -hmm. mine? So every time you want it to bubble up, you have to add a little bit what? more bubbly stuff. Alka Seltzer. Mm -hmm. Or anything I'll... that causes the fizz. Yeah. Like Sprite or stuff. Well, you wouldn't add Sprite because Sprite has sugar to it, right? Uh huh. So let's put that in. I think you put a hole in it, didn't you? That's a lot. What? Did you just put a hole in it? Uh uh. Oh, so now the one thing you gotta do, kids at home, is make sure that you don't <gasps> spill it. <laughs> that was a lucky one. That's why we put the lids on, right, assistant? So we I don't want to, to spill it. <laughs> so, assistant, do you know why this works like it does? Uh, because it works. Because water and oil don't mix, does it? Yeah. So the water and the oil doesn't mix. So when it, the Alka-Seltzer hits it, it causes the water to bubble. And the water has the food coloring in it, so it takes it up, it hits the top, and then it comes all the way back down like that. Yeah. And that's why you see the bubbles at the bottom too. And that's why you need Alka-Seltzer. That's right. And every time you want the bubble, you just add a little Alka-Seltzer to it. Yeah, or you just shake it up. Or you can shake it up, but if you shake it up, it won't cause the bubbles to rise like that. So this is our super cool lava lamp experiment. Yeah. Now the assistant's mixed up a little bit because she shaked it. So and little, yours. So there's I'm... a bunch of little bitty bubbles in there. That's why that's why my, this one here is clear, and that one looks a little bit more red because it's been shaken. The well, more I you thought shake, it would look better. The more you shake it, the more little bitty bubbles up here. So you see right there, there's some little Little bitty, 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 bitty bubbles. Same with yours. Right there. You probably can't even see them. And that's why the whole thing actually looks red. Yeah. 
I so, like mine red. So, Assistant, do you think we should do more fun experiments? Yeah. I think so, too. I think it's a lot of fun. So, this one right here is how to make lava lamps. Let's show them a whole Alka-Seltzer. You think we should do a whole Alka-Seltzer in one? Yeah. What do you think it'll do if you put more Alka-Seltzer in it? I think it's just going to last longer. Can I put a whole Alka-Seltzer in mine? You should. I'm going to put one and a half. Whoa, look at it. Now, if you put too much in, you know what might happen? What? It might bubble up through the top. Can I do that to mine? So, look, we'll add one full one. So, look at that, assistant. Look at all of the bubbles Can I add one in our lava lamp. Can I add one full one to mine? Yep, just make sure that we don't spill them. So super careful. So you add that. I'll put my hand on it to make sure it doesn't spill. Now if you add a full one, you really can't actually put the top on it because if you do, what it'll do is it'll cause it to uh, maybe explode. Oh, oh. Whoa, look at hers. Now hers has more water in it too. Remember in this one, we didn't put much water. So that's why she's got more bubbles. Right. Now whose do you think will last longer with bubbles? Going up and down, yours or mine? Yours. That's right, because you have less water, or you have more water, so it creates more bubbles faster. Yeah. Now, since mine's almost done, I can go ahead and put my lid on, like that. Can I put my lid on? Sure can, I'll hold it, and you put your lid on. And that is our lava lamp experiment. Now, people at home, if you want to see more cool experiments, push right there for, and that way you'll see TEF Kids, and, and check out that because that's our second channel. By the way, the bottles come sold separately. The food coloring, the sizzle yep. stuff. Yeah, uh, the sizzle stuff, also known as Alka Seltzer. All of it sold separately, but it, it's a pretty easy and cheap experiment to make just so that you can have some fun. Yeah. And, and also if, rem remember to subscribe. Like if you have this kit and you're recycling bottles, like if you ask your mom or your dad, can I take some bottles for my experiment? That will be fine, just plain old bottles. That's right. So remember to subscribe right here. Follow us on Facebook and Twitter. And our secret spelling word is going to be science. S-C-I-E-N-C-E -E -E spells science. So type that into the comments. All right, everyone. Have a great day. Bye. Bye. Hey there, everyone. Thanks for watching our video. Now make sure that you subscribe to the Engineering Family so you can see lots of cool videos. In fact, there's another cool video right there. You can select and watch it. I think you're really going to like it. Is it Team Umuzumi, Paw Patrol, Surprise Eggs, Frozen, Blade, Masha? There are so many videos to watch. Bye.